It is a rainy Sunday night in Bogota. CGTN has been invited on a police patrol on what is often considered one of the most violent days in Colombia, Mother's Day. We patrol certain neighborhoods because historically we have seen the families gather for barbecues and lunches, so they drink alcohol and we start to see fights. As we arrive to a police station, this man is being taken in for domestic violence against his partner. The police officer tells us the man was drunk. Police officials say the rain has made it a slow night. We could say it is the effect of alcohol, family discussions or melancholy because of a family member who has passed. Someone feels guilty and there's violence. To counter the violence, Bogota had 3,000 more policemen to help patrol this weekend. The police are outside bars and clubs, responding to fights and performing random background checks to make sure there are no illegal weapons. In 2016, there were 17 homicides, an increase from 2015, and almost 4,000 reports of violence, according to Bogota's police. Piedad, a mother of two, never imagined she would be a victim of domestic violence. We were sitting with our family celebrating, and I asked a man to change the music. My husband got jealous and began hitting me. As we finish the interview, her husband verbally threatens her and her children in front of the police. The man seems to be sobering up, but shows no remorse for his actions. Police officials tell us this goes far beyond the need to prohibit alcohol, that citizens need to learn how to celebrate so that a day meant to celebrate love doesn't become a motive for hate. Michelle Vegas, CGTN, Colombia.